Kickoff time in B105, suburb of origin. Now, don't be afraid of it. The mums, the dads, the kiddies, you should go in hard yourself and tackle the big one. Dun, 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 dun. It is back again tonight. We have tickets to see the Queensland Reds take on Natal at Bellingmore this Friday night. Defending champ, we've got Owen Lockett of Hillcrest. Owen, how are you tonight? Oh, fine, thanks, Joey. How are you, mate? I'm fine, thanks for asking. A bit of brain food there, Owen? Oh, I just had my spinach, yeah. Oh, good on you. Hey, tonight I want your buzzer noise to be a microwave oven bell. Ding. Good on you. Oh, well, if you think that spinach <laughs> is going to help you tonight, then it's a very, very sad state of affairs because come on, I mate. have... No, come on, Owen. Wake I've got, up, wake up. Smell yeah, the daisies. Yeah, you're going to be waking up and smelling the daisies tonight. Donna Parks came running down here. She's a personal fitness trainer, so she's on the ball already. She's got a 0.5% basic percentage of fat on her body. She's a Pisces, and she's from Northgate. She's going to whip your ass, OK? Yeah, well, I'm an Aquarius. And I'm 14 stone. So these days. Yeah, but sweetheart, you know what happens to Aquarius? Yeah. Okay, okay. Really nice they swim to the front. No, right. they're really nice. Hey, listen, guys, shut up for a minute. Can you put Donna on, please, Rachel? Yeah, all right. Okay. All right, I'll get you later. No worries. Hello, Donna. Hello. Uh, how are you, Donna? Good. Now, tonight I want your buzzer noise to be a slap in the face with a dead fish. All right. Uh, can you press your buzzer for me? Bud. <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, Owen, Donna, Donna, Owen. G'day. Hey. All right, best of five questions, guys. We're playing for tickets to Bellymore this Friday night. Here we go. Question one, who won Best Actress in this year's Academy... Dad. Oh, yes, Donna. Jessica Lang. It was. Yeah. All righty. Question two. Yay. Who's replacing... Who's? Re up. Shut up, Rachel. <laughs> who's replacing Craig McDermott to go to the Windies? Ding. Owen. It has to be uh, Carl Rackman. It sure does. Question three, Demi Moore is married to which... Ding. Bruce Willis. Ah, uh, gee. <laughs> Donna. No. Do you, just, you better press your buzzer again for me. Okay, fun. Okay, question four. It's 2-1 to Hillcrest. Who played Fred Flintstone? Ding. Owen? Uh, Fred uh, was Alan. Alan, Alan. Papa. Oh, no, it was John Goodman, you idiot. Oh, you idiot. All right, I hang on. Okay, which rockers played at the MCG last night? Ding. Owen. Rolling Stones. It was the Rolling Stones, <laughs> Owen. You've done it again. You've got yourself tickets to Ballymore. Donna, I'm sorry. Oh, well. Oh, well, Hillcrest goes off right again. <laughs> We're going to have a new challenging <laughs> suburb for sorry, you Rach. again. And, uh, oh, well, there you go. And uh, coming up next, the inside story, thanks to Phillips and the Cool Sea. See you later, guys. See ya. There's only one. 460 watts of thumping peak output power. Take a closer look. Now, the inside story. <laughs> It is B105's Top 30 Waiting Room, your last chance right now to get your votes in. Double two three double O double five. All happening right after this. B105's all new Top 30 returns. Just wait. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I don't know, I just like the taste. B105's all new Top 30. With thanks to Coca-Cola. Hello, it is Stewie and Rach. We oh, hang are on, back. Hang on, hang on, hang on. What now? Have you got a tissue? Why? I can't start the show until I blow my nose. No, I don't. I'm sorry. The Top 30 Confessional is back tonight. We're going to get you to open your heart, confess all your sins with Father Nice and Sister Bloody Mary. Could score yourself a copy of M People's Bizarre Fruit CD. A double to see them live this Saturday night at Festering Hall, like she's doing. And also meet them in the flesh, all thanks to Kalua Music for Your Mouth. Rachel, what is wrong with you? Oh, I've just had a, I've had a big day at the Academies today. <laughs> <laughs> I've got all the goss on what actually happens on the Academy Awards tonight on Channel 9. Okay. And uh, Scott Silverman's coming in. And Scott is a queer comic from San Francisco. Super duper. Is that it? Yeah, you'll be looking forward to that, won't you, Stuart? i got my boxes on. I'm ready for it. <laughs> Number 30, this is Turn around. Cut no, I'm Bend over. Ah. I've been forgotten, been forgotten, I where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from, Cutna Joe? That is Redneck at number 30, Cutna Joe, Brisbane's only nightly countdown, B105's all-new top 30 with Stewie and the sniffle one, Rachel. No, no, I'm fine. I think we should actually point out to Jacqueline, our producer, who's been with us, what, for six months now? Oh, I don't know. I've only been here a little light while. on the wall goes on... I mean, hey, but I can say the same about you, because you'll get this microphone and go like this. And... Yeah, but I only do it to annoy you. I do it deliberately. It works. <laughs> now, um, what did you think of the academies today? Hey? I thought it sucked a big one. What? 
the Academy. What? Well, I think Tom Hanks is just overrated. I'm sick of Tom. Yeah, but he is the first person in 50 years to get it back to back. Now, as far as I'm concerned, John Travolta and Pulp Fiction should have clean swept. If you didn't, if you haven't heard already who's won, close your ears now. Um, <laughs> Tom Hanks won, all right? Tom Hanks won everything. But I've got this theory after seeing it today, because I saw it live as it was coming through. Of course that, you um, <laughs> As you do. Um, that... Most like, if you mention your wife, okay, if an actor gets up and mentions his wife and that says how much he loves them, <laughs> then he's obviously just finished having an affair. Right? Really? Yep. So it's like when you go on a holiday from yep. your girlfriend yep. and you don't ring her for like four days and then you go, yep. hi darling, I love you. Yep, yep. How's You're it been going? You're having an affair for sure. You're having an affair oh, for really? sure. Right? So that's what the story is. So <laughs> if you're going to watch it later tonight, watch out and see who mentions their wife what they say about them, you can be guaranteed they've just had an affair. And then look in the audience. And if they're sitting in an aisle seat, they're up for an academy. They're going to get it for sure. Because Tom Hanks, I knew this as soon as I walked in, because Tom Hanks sits right at the front on the aisle and John Travolta is, like, banished to the back. You've just got it all sussed, haven't you? Yep, got it sussed. 29, this is Immature, Never Lie. B105's all new Top 30. Thanks to Coca-Cola, it is Brisbane's only nightly countdown. V105's all new top 30, that is Green Day at number 28. When I come around, Stewie and Rachel. I want to oh, no. know. What? I want to know if anybody went into a record store today to get Silver Chair's new album, Frog Stomp, and they were all sold out. Do and I want to know if anybody who did get the album didn't like it. Or maybe they did. Mm. And what would be the number that they would call Double two three double o double five, but you can also win a pizza too right on that now. Same line. Yeah, good <laughs> on you. <laughs> Hamilton, Marsden, and Oxley. That's They're the it. pizza relief suburbs tonight. If you live in those and you'd like a pizza, thanks to Pizza Hut, give us a call. And this is TLC from Crazy Six Cool, number twenty seven. Creep. You know five's all new top thirty. Cover album. What do you think of it? I don't think it was worth it for 30 bucks. You don't think it's worth it? No. Have you listened to it from the beginning right through to the end? No, I haven't. <laughs> well, yeah. I think you should. You reckon? Mm, why not? Well, I don't know. I mean, I'm not that crash hot on it myself. <laughs> well, you could take it back and exchange it for a great Beatles CD. Oh, yeah, you on your hey, I like the Beatles. Go, yeah. oh, no! Turn on. Thanks to Coca-Cola, it is Brisbane's only nightly countdown. V105's all new top 30. That is The Real McCoy, number 26. Another night, another dream with Stewie and Rachie, baby. Am I allowed to say Rachie, baby? Yeah, you just can't say Rachio. Okay. It makes me feel like a football or an ice cream. Rachio! It makes you sound like a... Chooka! It makes you sound like Macca. a cherry ripe or something. Good you know? on ya! Rachio, like a chuppa chup. All right, who won pizzas? Amy O'Reilly. <laughs> Ronald Gebby and Daniel Lorcan. You can pick the suburb you live in. It's either Hamilton, Marston or Oxley. And you've all scored yourselves pizzas thanks to Pizza Hut. Good for you. Hey, also coming up in People, we're going to get you to step into our top 30 confessional, open your heart with Father Nice and Sister Bloody oh. Mary. Yes, we yes. want your sins. Your sins. We do, we do. Hey, a copy of M People's Bizarre Fruit CD. You're going to see oh, them live cool. this Saturday night at Festival Hall and also get to meet them in the flesh thanks to Kalua. And Music Scott Silverman's mouth. coming in soon too. Oh, is he one of these queer comics? No, he's a Jewish comic. Oh, okay. Okay. He just happens to be gay. Uh, Spidey's coming up. Top 25 right after this. <laughs> the B1 Spidey! Spidey! Does whatever a spider can. Spins a web any size. Catches feet just like guys. Look out. Here comes the Spider-Man. Those families are so good, aren't they, right? Mm. Are, you guys, are you guys feeding your faces again? Yeah. Well, you know, somebody's got to do it. That's right. Oh. Hi, Spidey. Nice, no, Jordan. Good are you me. working tonight? Yes, I am. I'm not mm. playing video games tonight. What, what are you yeah? doing? Well, I'm, I'm on Boston Street. Opposite, I'm, I'm looking at the Queensland Cricketers Club, and upstairs there's a, a myriad of people all in suits and ties and champagne glasses going, love your work, love your work, love your work. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. I'm over the road. They're having an anti-Queensland Bulls party over here. Oh. I'm at the Pizza Haven across the road. Great right I'm boy. with Loretta, and she's really upset. You want to have a chat to her? Loretta. Loretta. Hi. Hello. Who named you after a school? Pardon? Who named... Oh, don't worry about it. What's, what are you upset about? Well, all these piss people come over and just, like, order pizzas and they just forget about them and... <laughs> You know, hey, Yahoo and hey what, what, what's the favourite pizza? Like, what, what does a pissed idiot order at this time of night? Uh, a vegetarian. Oh, really? <laughs> I thought you'd just have one with oh, ham and pineapple. No, no. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay, well, thanks very well, much. It's been, it's been scintillating having that chat, Loretta. Thanks for your time. You and happy pizzering. Thanks. I hope Spidey gets a free yeah, one. Did. Yeah, what else have you got to give away, Spider? Oh, I've got some one on one basketball magazines, heaps of red and stimpy cards, and Star Trek cards, uh, loads of other stuff. I'm going to follow the trail of empty beer cans to find out where the bulls have gone next, so. 
<laughs> I thought you just followed the ball. Boom, boom. Love you, Bob. Street, Peace to heaven. I'll talk to you later. Okay, oh, buddy. Yeah, 24. This is Arrow. Hot, hot, hot. B105's on your top 30. Hot, hot, hot on two. That's Bon Jovi at number 23. Someday I'll be Saturday night. It is Brisbane's only nightly countdown. B105's all new top 30. And thanks to Coca-Cola, Stewie and he's a, Rach. He's a good Jewish boy, old Scott, isn't he? Scott who? Scott Silverman. He's just walked in. He's, oh gonna, he's, gonna, he's our guest. He's our big celebrity on the top 30 tonight. Oh, that's right, of course. Our budget has pushed far enough to get the Scott Silverman all the way from San Francisco into B105's top 30. Do you think I should stop picking my toenails now? I think it might be a nice idea, and I right. think you should pay respect to the Jewish people of this nation. Wonderful. This is 22. London Beat, come back. B105's all new top 30. Have we got bagels for him? Come back. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Rock Watch. Yes, that's me. <laughs> I was just writing a couple of questions down for our guest celebrity DJ tonight, Scott Silverman, mm-hmm. who we'll be talking to very soon. But enough of enough of the American celebs. Let's get down to our very own Australian. Michael Hutchins, as we all know, has been at it again with Paula Yates. Yeah, but those but, pictures in all them. Well, somebody asked me the other day, do I really think they're having an affair? And? Well, is Keanu Reeves married to David Geffen? Bumper. Uh, I think so. You I do? I think so. Yes, I do think so. And oh, I think that on. Michael has been doing the jammy with Paula Yates for far too long now. They should jump out of the closet, both of them, get their clothes off, get on the front pages of the newspapers and declare their love and passion for each other. Meanwhile, nobody's heard from Helena Christensen, have they? Where's Helena? Where, has, where is Helena? Where mm, has she been? Mm, Kylie cares? Minogue was staying in LA just oh, recently, yes. right? <laughs> and Paula Yates is staying in the same hotel. Wow. Well, no, but Kylie went like bright red when she saw Paula and steam came out of her ears. So does this mean Kylie is still in love with Michael or is she just in love with Paula? Oh, spank me with a chainsaw, right? Oh, please don't say that. Why don't they just get together and put me out of my misery? You can see they're meant for each other. I guess we'll just Woo! have to wait and see. Get back to Ramsey Street, 6.30 to get back to on Ram. Channel 10. This is B105's all-new <laughs> Top 30. Thanks to Coca-Cola with Stewie Wright and uh, Scott Silverman. Hey. Hello. How are you? Get back to Ramsey Street. <laughs> <laughs> are you the funny one or the sexy one? Uh... <laughs> You're a bit of both, aren't you, Scott? I hate you. <laughs> do you, you. watch Neighbours? I'm both, goddammit. I'm funny and sexy. Oh, it can yeah. be done. Do you, Prove it. Do you watch Neighbours? Um, I watch the song, but I can't take it after the song. Have good neighbours. <laughs> they don't have that in San Fran, do they? No. <laughs> do you call it San Fran or SF? Uh, we call it San Fran and SF and San Francisco. And what does SF stand for? San Francisco. Oh, right. Yeah, right, right. Well, it stands for something else that I can't say. <laughs> we're going to be talking to Scott a little bit later on. Well, real soon, well, we're actually. we're talking to him now, aren't we? Well, we are, actually. Go away, Scott. We're here for a little while. I'll go away. Okay. The Top 30 Confessional is coming up. <laughs> Maybe you could do this. Open your heart with uh, Father Nice and Sister yes, Bloody yes, Mary. Yes, let's get Scott to uh, do it. Yeah, the copy of M People's Bizarre Fruit CD. Uh, see him live this Saturday night at Festering Hall. And also get to meet, touch him. And if you voted for these, we'll come Bizarre up. Fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Since you've given up cigarettes and coffee, you've got a little bit more hyper. Number 20, this is 4pm, Sukiyaki, B105's top 30. You can answer that. What? It's all because... Thanks to Coca-Cola, Brisbane's only nightly countdown. B105's all new top 30, number 19. That is Mosaic, nothing in the world. It is Stewie and Rach and Scott Silverman. Hello. How are you? Now, you're at the Le Bois thing. At the Le Bois theatre. Oh, darling. On what nights? <laughs> I'm there uh, tomorrow night through April 1st. So Wednesday night, Thursday night, Friday night, Saturday night. Two shows on Saturday, one at 10.30. I think the first one sold out already. So. And so what brings you up here then? Apart to from the shows. Brisbane? Yeah. Uh, well, you know, to come and spread the word that homosexuality is good here in Brisbane. Yay! <laughs> All right. So that's the mainstay of your um, stand-up no, routine, is really. it? No, not really. No, not really. Or do you have a problem being Jewish as well? Uh, I have problems with everything. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Rachel, well, and... that's being Jewish, isn't it? Yeah. No, no, no. I just have problems with stupidity, and whenever yeah. I encounter it, I like to point it out, and that's uh-huh. basically my act. So you've been and... pointing since you got here. Yeah, I <laughs> have not stopped pointing at <laughs> Kylie Minogue, okay? Oh, I know. I went to see Scott on Saturday night, and I was absolutely shocked about what you had to say about it's Kylie. shocking. What'd you I say? Kylie you was say? like Judy. Kylie was like Judy Garland and, a, and an idol, and Barbara Streisand, an idol for all gay men. No, no, no. Those are the ones that don't worship Madonna or Courtney Love already. <laughs> 
Courtney. We love Courtney. We love Courtney. We do love Courtney. Now, you've just, you've just given up coffee and cigarettes. Yes, I have. And how are you coping? A um, lot of hand wringing. <laughs> <laughs> like you're doing the right now. A lot of, lot of, lot of push-ups, a yeah. lot of walks, a lot of long walks, and I've been eating a lot of carrots. Because I, I keep figuring if I'm, like, eating something and I bought all these carrots at the market, then it'll go away. Why? What are carrots good to do with anything? I have no idea. You can't mm. smoke carrots, can you? Well, there you can hold them in your mouth like them. a cigarette. <laughs> you look pretty good. That's stupid. I only do it in my apartment. I'm locked up. I'm trapped. Help me. <laughs> this is quarter set at 18. It's our time. It's Bruno 5. Stop 30. <laughs> Stomp, stomp, stomp. Thanks to Coca-Cola, it is Brisbane's only nightly countdown. B105's all new top 30 at 17, Hocus Pocus. Here's Johnny. Is that your favourite song, Scott? Oh, God, that song sucks. <laughs> what kind of music do you like? Um, I like all kinds of music. I love the beautiful South. I love Madonna. And I love that also American music called grunge. So you love Courtney. I love Courtney. <laughs> I love Courtney. I love Courtney if you're listening. I love you, Courtney. <laughs> she's of course, she's probably listening. in jail somewhere. Oh, she might be listening. <laughs> uh, it's Dewey and Rach, and we're talking with Scott Silverman, who's going to be playing at La Boite. What, for the next couple of weeks? Well, no, no, I just Saturday night. night. Oh, okay. So there's not, there's not many tickets left, so you've got to rush out and get some. Yeah, Wednesday now, through Saturday. Hurry. What, what's the funniest part about your act? Uh, the fact that I'm able to get there and do it. <laughs> I got the funniest part of my act. All right, then. So what have you thought of Brisbane so far? Oh, it's been a lot of fun. You have very large bugs here. Bugs. Uh, bugs yeah. Bugs, you know. Cockroaches. Cockroaches. Yeah, right. And spiders, too, that are really big. One of them climbed across the front of my, front of my friend's Mazda, and I thought I was going to die. It, really? just, it made an audible sound. Yeah. Bum, 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 the eye was over it. <laughs> well, all right. Well, okay. I've got to ask you, though. Mm-hmm. No, actually, I might save it for the guest DJ quiz. Okay. This is 16 Offspring Self Esteem. Is this. Oh, sorry. Hang on. I was going to do that. You, 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 you want to be a radio announcer, so go. Um, this next song is Self Esteem by the Offspring. <laughs> 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 Hello, Spider, and this is Scott Silverman. I'm calling. I've taken over your radio station here, and I just want to see what's going on. Oh, well, we play this really silly game here called Cricket, Scott. <laughs> I've seen it. Oh, you've seen it? Uh-huh. People like running up and down a picture of, uh, like, sort of hard grass. Well, anyway, the team of our sort of Brisbane people won today. And I'm at this nightclub with about 400 million other Yobbo feral people drinking heaps of beer. Oh, great. <laughs> and they showed me one of their theme songs. I'll sing you the clean version if you like. Oh, go for it. Okay. On the fifth day of finals, my true love sent to me the Sheffield Shield. Whatever. Okay, Spider-Man, we got the point. <laughs> okay. I'm a city rivals with a band of Brazilian cricket fans because Queensland won the Shield. And Queensland are here. And it's really exciting. But I suppose you already knew that. Yeah, I, I'm very excited too. <laughs> I, can, I can see it. I can, I can tell. I can hear the sincerity in your voice. Oh, yeah. What can I say? Um, how about King Gang Gooly 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 Wash Wash King Gang Goo King Gang Goo? Uh, no, can't say that. All right, then. Would you like me to tell you what I'm giving away? Yes, please. Right, I'm giving away some one more basketball magazine. Some red and snippy stuff. Uh, I might give away some of the locks of hair of the Queensland Bulls so I can find them. Anything else I can lay my hands on? That's Great. Well, you do that. Okay. You give it away. Give it away. Give it away. <laughs> Oh, I'm just funny. Hey, this is um, Boys to Men. Thank you. Would you like to say that too? Oh, I hate Boys to Men. Oh, so do I. <laughs> five, <laughs> top 30. I like and I thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, and thank, thank you to you. Coca-Cola, just, Brisbane's only say, nightly countdown. B105's all new if top 30. What? I just yeah. have to say, I love putting that on the end of Boys to Men songs for all those people out there who are taping the song. I know. So you can continue now, Stuart. <laughs> I forgot where it was. <laughs> that was 15. Oh, yeah, it is um, Stewie, Rach, and we've got Scott Silverman. Hi. Uh, <laughs> Hey, we've got a test drive happening right now. Prince, yay. Okay, Scott, you tell us all about it. You were there. You were there. there. I was there when the Purple Medley was first performed at the American Music Awards. I saw it performed live, and visually it was incredible. I mean, he's not much to look at. I mean, he's 3'9 or something. I find him so repulsive Yeah, he's gross, but he's a great musician. And, I mean, he's been around since I was in high school. I mean, I I actually thought Little Red Corvette was about the car. (laughs) But yeah. it's not. The but other is, fag in no, the other fag in my class, Steve Jenkins, <laughs> who finally came out this year, about time Steve, yeah, Steve. <laughs> yeah, Steve told me that it was about a woman's vagina. It's about 
one of the juts. <laughs> Can you believe it? No way. I thought it was going to fade. This is a... Cra- <laughs> very fast for juts, though. <laughs> I know. Very Good fast. looking one, too, apparently. This is the Prince Melody. Give us a call at uh, Test Drive 223 Was it automatic or manual? Stick shift, baby. <laughs> Top 30. Thanks to Coca-Cola, it is Brisbane's only nightly countdown. B105's all new top 30, number 14, Master Well, When I Was a Sperm, and before that, our test drive, Prince Melody. That's your cue. That's your cue. Oh, okay, Melody. we're going to start asking people what they thought line <laughs> number one. Yeah, we've got it. Okay. What's his name? Uh, what? Luke from McGrath. 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 Sorry. Luke. Come on. Hello. Hello. Hi, Luke. What'd you think? Oh, I thought it was pretty good. What about you? Oh, I thought it was great. Oh, that's good. Yeah, good so on that's you, Luke. two votes for. And next, Alan from Elise, uh, uh, Acacia Ridge. Oh, you got that right. Oh. Yes, hello. Alan, what'd you think? Yeah, the song is average, but the Prince thing yeah. just ruins the whole thing, chucks it down the drain, you know? What do you mean the Prince thing? Sounds more like Prince. It is Prince. It is Prince. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Who's the next okay, person? line three, Natalie from Brackenridge. Um, yeah, I thought it was pretty cool. Oh, mm-hmm. cool. Thanks, Natalie. Yep. Okay. We'll Bye. tell Prince. Or that guy we'll with the symbol Prince. name. Not Prince, it's the artist formerly known as Prince. Okay. <laughs> it's now it's Kim from Holland Park. In line four. What do we think, Kim? I thought it was really crap. Did you oh. want? Well. Because you've heard all the songs before. <laughs> It's not It's not Prince, is it? Yeah. yeah. All right, it is. I like him. Good on you. So to center, uh, line five, we've got Jade from Bellbird Park. Jade, what'd you think? Oh, it was absolute crap. Why? It was totally stupid. And can, so, can I say how much Miranda and Nikki... Oh, for God's sake, you can't say anything. Imagine... Really? It was totally Ugh. crap. Well, I mean, really, three people hated it, two people liked it, you liked it. I loved it. And I you liked know, it. all those songs were number one You hit, liked it. So I, didn't, right I never said wrong. I liked it or didn't like it. Oh, really? I have not formed or expressed an opinion. Really? On Ooh. this particular Gee, melody. okay, well, I liked it. So uh, if you did like it, you can vote for it. Double two three double o double five. We're going to come back and we'll talk some more with Scott Silverman. We've got the top 13. Pearl Jam, right after this. Yeah. All she wants to do. Thanks to Coca Cola, it is Brisbane's only nightly countdown. V105's all new top 30. That is Pearl Jam at 13. Up for you, Stewie Rach. Scott Silverman, you're still here. Yes, I see London, I see France, I see Stuart's underpants. He's <laughs> totally wearing underwear here, just boxer shorts. That's all he ever wears. That's normal. Stuart comes I in. I wear that too. Stuart comes in every day and it's like he's forgotten to put his jeans on. It's so he's strange. Got, well, it is strange. Well, it's it? strange. You what told me you, you wore boxers. I did, but that was when I was in college and I would have had a beer for breakfast. Yeah. I was stumbling <laughs> to class in a robe and combat boots. <laughs> Scott, so do you think Stuart's attractive? Um... He's very nice. No. I mean, <laughs> you're not my type. Sorry, Stuart. <laughs> That's right. You probably don't find Don't Scott put poor father, Stuart on the... Bu- <laughs> That's the biggest nightmare. Some fag going, oh, yeah, Stuart's a doll. <laughs> puff, puff, puff. I love you, right? <laughs> you too, Scott. Come over here for a bit of a spanking. This is Nikki <laughs> Friends. Long. <laughs> <laughs> Total Eclipse of the Heart. V105. You're top 30. I'm going for a walk now. Thanks to Coca-Cola, it's Brisbane's only nightly countdown. V105's all new top 30. Tricked me. <laughs> totally tricked me. And Rachel Stewie. and yeah, Scott Silverman, number 12. That's Nikki French, Total Eclipse of the Heart. Well, originally DJ done by Christmas. Bonnie Tyler. Yeah, thanks for that. <laughs> really you're, you're a wealth of musical knowledge. Aren't I you? try and keep abreast of what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> so does Stewie. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right, no, no, Scott no. Silverman. Yes. All right, man from the valley. I'm, I am okay. from the valley. Yeah. Yes. With true. an accent like that, where else could you be from? <laughs> okay, uh, this is guest DJ quiz time. I'm going to ask you three questions. Oh, shit. You okay. have to answer them as honestly and correctly and passionately as you possibly can. Uh. So when we all slip on our sequence. <laughs> Question number one. If you were to place an ad in the personal columns, what would you say? Uh, um, if you have a nice car, I'll go out on a date with you. That's, That's what I'd say. So you're superficial. I am so shallow. <laughs> and you have Mazda no Estina or an RX-7 oh, okay. or um, a Porsche, any Porsche, anything from Stuttgart is okay with me. All right, then. <laughs> Stuttgart. Okay, your best pickup line. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, uh, this is my real hair. <laughs> That's it. I don't have pickup lines. Actually, They're usually used on me. Oh, I have the best pickup line. I have something in my eye, and I think it's you. Oh no! Uh, <laughs> no. Yes, I like that. Have you heard the one about where you go up to you go up to a girl or a it's guy, and you put forty cents down in front of them, right? And you walk away. 
And eventually they're going to come up to you and go, what's this 40 cents for? And you go, well, that's so you can call your mother and tell her you won't be home tonight. Ooh. Okay, question number three. What advice would you give to young people thinking of jumping out of the closet or those thinking of converting to Judaism? Um, uh, first of all, I'll struggle with the coming out of the closet question. Um, do it. Uh, your parents will not be surprised. No. <laughs> Everybody's, everybody I know who's gay, when they finally came out to their parents, their parents are like, oh, honey, we knew. We were waiting for you to figure it out. Or thank God, you know, like, you know, let's talk about it. And if there's a problem, you know, talk it out. See a therapist if you have to. It's a big thing, but you should definitely do it. It's very important to realize who you are and to... Um, it's this simple, all right? What was I know. I've always said I've got oh, flags, oh, flags oh. flying, and it's like, go west. The village people are going to the This is worse than Forrest Gump. I know. Gay is gay does. So. Oh. Oh, thanks, God. Okay. Uh, okay, this is okay, your no song, Scott. No, no, no. This is your song. What is it? Come on, come on. Come kiss. as you are by the late Kurt Cobain and Nirvana. I love him. On the top 30. And there it goes. And there it was. <laughs> it's B105's all new top 30. Thanks to Coca Cola. The cranberries are number 11. Oh, to my family. You have a wonderful family, don't you? I love Scott. my family. Yes. <laughs> my which, which member of your family do you love the most? Oh, I don't pick favorites, but my mom's definitely the biggest character. She calls me a prick tease. I was just telling you. Yeah. About that. I just wanted. Why? You said you were really prudish. Yeah, because I don't put out. Sorry. My oh, boyfriend hates me. Oh. Yeah. Well, it's messy, and it messes up my hair, and. You know, I could be doing <laughs> other things. But you just you just told us that Stewie reminded oh, you of an God. ex-boyfriend. He did. He and totally you, looked... What did you do in a Bronco? Bought a Ford <laughs> Bronco or something? I don't know. Panic. You see, for us here in Brisbane, a Bronco is a football team, not oh. a car. Well, Bronco is that car that O.J. Simpson yes. drove on that famous slow chase. O.J., whatever. But I just want to say that Stewie is so lucky because he works with two of the prettiest girls oh, here, Jackie O and is. Rachel. Oh, They're such foxes, sweet. man. They're the foxes of B105, <laughs> man. <laughs> and I look like your old boyfriend. I feel I, so well, I, I dated him. God, yeah, I didn't date either of these two girls. At least you wanted to bonk him. It yeah, like I totally Trust wanted me. to bonk him. Christ almighty. Now, listen, where are you performing again? Let's just get that plug in one more I time. I am performing at the La Boite Theater plug. Um, Wednesday <laughs> through Saturday, two shows on Saturday. Come out and see me, especially if you have a nice yeah. car. Or and just, or just come more. out. Yeah, or just come out. It's very <laughs> important. Scott, Scott, thank you for coming in. Oh, thank you, Stewie. And can you go away now? <laughs> I'll try. Oh, I want your Stewie. underpants. Yeah. Daybreak. Across. Now, I'm the best rent there is. The Adventures of Priscilla, Queen of the Desert, on video. If it's not in, it's not on. <laughs> well, Lordy B, it is B105's all-new top 30. Coming up soon, we're going to get you to step into our confessional and open your heart with Father Nice and Sister Bloody Mary. We want to know your deepest, darkest, hairiest sins. Good score for yourself, a copy of M People's Bizarre Fruit CD. You're going to get to see them live this Saturday night at Festival Hall and also meet the band. All thanks to Kalua Music for your mouth. And if you voted for these, they're coming up. This is M People. See him live at Festival Hall this Saturday night. Open your heart. Do what I fuss. Top 30, help me. This is Father Nice, and that is Sister Bloody Mary. We have Darren Wheel on the line. Darren, we want you to step into our confessional, open your heart, and confess thy sins. Darren, what is your sin? Uh, I'm afraid I got the hots for Jackie. Jackie? Uh, Jackie who? Jackie who, yes. The one who works at the radio station. Oh. Jackie O, the producer of the Top 30. Yes. Yep, have you seen her? She's a dog! <laughs> Darren, she has a head like a twisted sand shoe, my son. You have sinned. Sinned. What, what do you want to do to Jackie, Darren? Oh, geez, I don't know. Come on, tell us. No, tell I... us what you'd like to sing with her. 
Go on. Do you want to touch her hair? Oh, I suppose. Yeah. Do you want to kiss her lips? <laughs> Do you want to fondle her chihubis? Do you want to stick your tongue down her gullet? Of course. Yes. Darren. <laughs> Darren. 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 You have sinned beyond belief. More than the Bible ever suggests to you that you should sin. You're a bad, bad boy, Darren. You've got yourself a copy of M. People's Bizarre Fruit CD and you're going to see them absolutely live this Saturday night at Festival Hall and also you get to meet them and do what you will do to Jack. All things to Kalua music for your mouth. You'll get to meet Jackie A this Saturday night too. Oh, that's good. All right, love. Yeah, right. B105. All thanks to Coca-Cola. It's Brisbane's only nightly countdown. B105's all new top 30. That's the Flaming Lips at number five. She don't use jelly. It is Stewie and Rach. What do you got there? I've got a um, community service announcement, I think. Please. Yes, well, this Friday night, <laughs> the school formal... Ex- you're a bit... You're a bit... You're a bit red and hot and flushed under the collar since Scott Silverman was in here, aren't you, Stewie? Yeah, I'm feeling okay weren't now. Weren't you sure how to cope, were you, love? No, I coped just Stayed fine. Stayed very hard and glued to the Thank seat, didn't you? You're Rachel. Didn't get up, didn't no. turn around. No, I'm oh. just absolutely fine. You book yeah. in you. Yes. Go on. Um, school Formal Expo 95 in the exhibition grounds this Friday night. I'm actually hosting the fashion parade that starts at 5.30 and 6.45. Funny, it starts being a community announcement (laughs) just because you're there. No, I've got to tell people about this because you can win all these things like formal dresses and suit high and chauffeured limos and makeovers and all that sort of stuff that you'd love to win, Mm. Stewie. Spesh. Hey, come up also. We've got the code word. Keep it close in the top four entrance. Hang on. It's at RNA Showgrounds. Okay. All thanks to Coca-Cola, it is Brisbane's only nightly countdown, B105's all new top 30. That's in trance at number four. Set you free. It is Stewie and Rach here. You're going to do the top 30 tomorrow night all on your own. I sure you? am, yes. Any reason why, Rach? Are you going to tell everyone? No. Okay, no. great. If you got the code word when you voted between five and seven this afternoon, double two three double eight double five, give us a call right now. I just have a problem with my cervix. Okay. <laughs> Edwin Collins. Uh, it's got to be removed because it's not being used. A girl like you. Who would have five stops 30? Praise the Lord, she's dying. It's Brisbane's only nightly <laughs> countdown. B105. All oh, new Sit top down. 30. It's all thanks to Coca Cola. That was uh, Alpha Team. What a speed at number two. Put, and put, put Claire's mic on. We have got uh, Stewie, go on. Chris Betts. Hello, Chris. How's it going? From Albany Creek. I'm really well. Do you know what the code word was tonight? I've got yes. no idea. Yeah, yes. what was it? Prestige. What was it? Prestige. 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 Oh, Prestige vehicle hire. Yes. Hey, Chris. Yeah. Because you were so smart and you remembered that the whole night, you got yourself <laughs> a limited edition CD of Bon Jovi. Someday I'll be uh, the other night. And also sure. their best of Crossroads thing. And now you're in the draw for a night at the Marriott Hotel at Surfers. Chauffeur driven there and back by Prestige vehicle hire. Vehicle hire. Yeah. Wow well, about that, hey? Not bad. Yeah. That's great. Thanks for calling. Okay, cool. Bye. Now, now, I just, I just want to ask Claire, has she got that big, huge hickey on her shoulder? And it's cupping. Have you ever heard of that What's ancient cupping? Chinese medicine? No. It's they put these suction caps on you where you've got a bit of a... Sorry, Stewie, he's going time, folks. And um, it drains the blood away from the wound they and put a better. suction. So they put a plunger on your back and then it's they It's a hickey, all right. Get it's off. It's a hickey. It's a big hickey. It's so round. <laughs> it's a very oh. round hickey. It's like uh, a meteor okay. landed on your Thanks, shoulder. Thanks, Hey, Australian mates coming next. What are you doing? Anything exciting? Yeah, actually, new to vinyls too. And uh, we're going to have Barry in... But... <laughs> Darren in from BMT too to tell us about some new releases. To vinyl, she used to wear my school. Pearl Jam, number one, number better man. Five, on, B105's on your top 30. Mm.